I'm uh, Peter Kalkvist, head of uh, Saab Indonesia. Uh, today we are displaying our uh, newest uh, fast attack craft concept. It's a stealth FAC. It's currently being built in uh, Banyuwangi, east of Java, together with our Indonesian partner, uh, North Sea Boats. Uh, this ship has uh, uh, lots of, of um, new and powerful capabilities. Um, starting from, from the front, it has uh, the newest Bufors 40mm gun that can fire programmable ammunition. It is in a stealthy cupola, so it will not be disclosed to uh, any uh, radar signature. Uh, it has an integrated bridge that uh, is totally connected to our combat management system. Uh, the bridge in itself has um, two seats to operate the ship. It's more like a uh, flight cockpit. Uh, integrated mast, where we have the electronic warfare system. We have the newest CGRF 3D radar and all the communication antennas. It's fully integrated into the mast. Uh, the mast is quite tall and that's on a, at, at the purpose, it's to, to increase the uh, surveillance range. We can do so because we have the, the lightweight sea giraffe that only weighs 135 kilo. Going off to the ship, uh, we have uh, the newest uh, RBS-15 Mark III missile. Uh, we have four uh, missiles installed inside the ship. That means that it uh, uh, adds to the stealth capability, meaning you cannot see uh, from outside that the ship carries missiles. Uh, propulsion system, four water jets, very powerful, can uh, propel the ship up to, to 40 knots. Um, the ship in itself is uh, wave piercing, that means that it cuts the waves, it doesn't ride the waves. That means it can operate up to sea state 5 in full speed. That is quite unique. Uh, it comes to the draft of the ship, it's only 1.2 meter. That means it can operate in very shallow water, it can even beach up on islands and hide. And then you reverse your, your uh, water jets and you pull out from the beach. That means that it also adds to the stealth capability. We have a combat information center uh, just below the bridge where we have four operators. All together the ship carry a, a crew of 20 people plus another seven people as part of our special forces or, or boarding uh, team because there is at the after the ship here we have a 12 meter rib that special forces use for intercept and for some patrol missions. So that the uh, rib can be launched at speed. Also when they're coming back uh, to be pulled up by the ship, they can do it while the main ship is still running forward. We have also the newest stealth fire control director, Cirrus 200. That is a radar uh, director plus electro-optical uh, capability. That one is of course connected to, to the Bofors gun and, and can deliver the, the new firing doctrine since we have the programmable ammunition. The typical uh, missions for this concept in peacetime is to, to do patrolling, can be out at 10 days. Uh, it uh, is designed to be able to counter illegal fishing, piracy, uh, drug smuggling, uh, as well as uh, uh, illegal immigrants. Uh, during wartime, the mission is actually to go out fast and launch the missiles. Go back in to replenish missiles, go out again. This is a very affordable concept. You can almost call it expandable. And that's the whole idea, to have something that is cheap enough and is fast and powerful enough to be out there and carry out the most uh, uh, deterrent uh, mission ever.